Okay, everybody, welcome back. This is the Kolsch. This is the Kolsch that I brewed with the new Kolsch dry yeast. So, as I promised, I'd come back and give you guys an idea of how this really compares to using the Y yeast liquid Kolsch yeast. Is that a cool glass? see that or not. It's like an inverted bottle in the glass. I got that from my son Jeff and his wife Corinne for my birthday. A couple of those. Very cool. Has the typical Kolsch uh, aroma to it. Uh, and keep in mind this has only been I think in the bottle for 10 days so uh, it's gonna get a little more carbonated although there is quite a bit of carbonation in there and just to uh, review, Kolsch should be really not a bitter beer. It should be crisp, but with, you know, just a, some people say a little fruitiness to it. I don't know that I've ever experienced uh, that. I do get a little sweetness uh, in it. Cheers. Wow. You know, to me, and I've had a lot of the Kolsch with the Y yeast, I don't notice a difference. It has the same flavor, the same body, mouth feel. Um, again, it hasn't been in the bottle more than like nine or 10 days, but it is great. I have another batch um, that's brewing or is conditioning in the bottles right now, which was from the same brew day. Um, and I used that yesterday. I wanted to check and see how carbonated it was. It wasn't quite as far along as this. Uh, so I used it uh, to actually uh, boil some bratwurst in, and man, they were the best brats I've ever had. So anyway, um, definitely go to the dry yeast if you're using the, the Y yeast and you find that you can't get through it quick enough and so you're, you know, losing a lot of money on, on liquid yeast. Otherwise, I'd say, you know, if you want to stay with the Y yeast, it's perfectly good. It's great. The only problem I have with Y yeast is that the shelf life on it isn't as great as dry yeast. So, anyway, I'm certainly switching over. I'm a con uh, convert now. So, uh, I'll definitely be using the dry yeast just uh, to safeguard uh, myself uh, from times when I think I might brew, but I don't. And then, you know, I have that issue where the yeast gets overage. So, anyway, uh, that's it. Uh, until we get together next time, hope you guys have a great week. Cheers. This has been a Maddie Boy presentation. Say bye bye, Maddie. Bye bye.